If I'm not really bored and crushingly alone. Hey, wait, what's that right there? Is that a game for me to play? Hey, wait a minute, it's just fucking fake! Gex! You know, the smart ass, crack wising animated lizard. And I know what you're thinking. Skylar, isn't that just a guy go lizard? Well, you'd be right. But there's also Gex too, so let me fill you in real quick. Gex the Gecko is what you might call a cinephile. You know, a movie and show enthusiast. Being such, Gex knows all the cool little catchphrases and all the one-liners from the at-the-time films. You'll be hearing this little gecko spouting more pop culture references than a Duke Nukem. Whether or not that's what's best for all of us is entirely up to you. Hmm, well a lot of television is make-believe. So what if I make believe that the game is real and it becomes real? Really? <gasps> God, it's real! Time to go put it in the N64! Did, did it actually move? <sighs> My version of the N64 is very rare. It's called the um, cardboard box with uh, PNG. Very legit, very real. Uh, how else could I even be playing Gex right now? <laughs> right? It's real. It's tail time. I need several adults. Gex enter the gecko. Or should I say, Gex enter the what is this shitty start menu has a starting out immediately right into the game. You, obviously, play as Gex. You're the suave tuxedo wearing pop culture poppin' lizard running around to James Bond music. There is no context. There will never be any context. All right, let's just get a handle on these here controls real quick. We got your base against 64 platformer stuff. Move around, jump, alternate jump, camera move, w weird lizard climb. Why is my life upside down? I am a lizard. This is good. So, after some careful maneuvering, I'm able to climb on top of the arches, zip zap over to the other side, and find the Titanic level. So, let's do it. Hey, wait a minute. This ain't Titanic. This is just underwater. Like, what part of the movie had geckos in diving suits spinning and eviscerating entire sharks? Underwater. This is a sham. This is Shamtanic. Oh, there's the real Titanic. Funny how it looks exactly like the iceberg that sunk it. But hey, these are N64 days. Icebergs are can be Titanics too sometimes. And that's okay. And here we are on the deck of the Titanic. Finally. Except it's totally vertical and has been made to easily be scaled by our lizard friend. Man, this is actually kind of... kind of hard. For me at least. Not only the weird jumps, but the, the camera angles are just actively working against me. Just look at me try to inch my way across this little pole. The camera just is not cooperating. It doesn't straighten up so I can just run across. Fucking this is no good. Oh, and if this isn't anything but exactly what I wanted. Getting caught in an infinite loop with Gex spouting innuendos about his lizard tongue. Licking my way to the top. Tongue, I think at one point or another, we've all needed to lick our way to the top. <laughs> Ugh, finally, I'm out of this garbage level! That's not even good! Alright, let's just look around a bit and see what else we got here. Huh. Right here is a cartoon level called Out of Tune. I get it. Forget about it! I will try. Alright, okay, now this seems like a first level. Not that underwater Titanic crap. I mean, this world is all colorful and totally classic Looney Tunes. Just look at this! This right here is a for sure nod to Bugs Bunny and his wild wacky adventures. Come to think of it, what reason would anyone have to be in a pose like that? 
That's a bad spot to be doing jumping jacks in. Or to be dying for our sins. One or the other. So, all in all, I like this level a lot more. It's just so... lively. Everything wants to kill me, even. Flowers with mallets, falling anvils, and hunters shooting slow-ass bullets, all just waiting to end my eccentric, amphibious existence. And I love it. Also, for a part of the level, Gex has got a little bunny suit on. Dow, oh, now you not adore it. He's, a, he's so cute. He's a, he's a little furry. Look at him. Nah, he's a, he's a cute little guy. Little lizard in a suit. Well, all right, this game's on my good side now. Let's do one more level and then call it quits. Huh. Smell Razor. You can tell that they definitely had a real comedian on the team for this stuff. Actually, they did. The comedian Dana Gould helped write many of the jokes for Gex, while also voicing him in the American versions. I've watched a lot of his comedy stand-up, and it's, it's quality stuff! But Smell Razor? Come on, man. You have, you have a family. Alright, here we go. The guy who had to sleep with the lights on for days after watching a video of Five Nights at Freddy's is now playing a scary level. Oh, 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 oh god, oh, what are those? Those are skelly heads! I don't like that, it's scary! It's scary skellies! <gasps> scary! Is, is that a dancing pumpkin? That, da that, that dancing pumpkin is for sure very spooky. Oh, oh god, the blood coolers. This is, that is rather frightening. I don't like being on a wall in a scary game. Oh god, is that a spooky, scary skeleton sending shivers down my spine? Shrieking skulls will shock my soul and seal my doom tonight? Reminds me of Halloween at Rip Taylor's. I don't get it. But I'm sure if I did, I'd be laughing a whole bunch. You're a funny man, Dana Gould. Funny even the most spoopingest, scariest games out there. But I can be a funny guy too. Yeah, I can be a funny guy. Here, listen to this one. What do they call a horror platformer? A jump scare. See, Skylar can be funny too. Watch out, Dana Gould. Skylar paying for the next Gex game. Damn, it feels good to be a gangster. A real gangster ass nigga plays his cards right. A real gangster ass nigga never runs his fucking mouth. Hello, and thanks for watching the video. If you want to see more funny stuff that I'm in, check these other guys' videos out. Top right video is Ultra Jerky's hilarious medical science video, and to the left of it is Ragnar's Top Fatalities in Mortal Kombat, which I actually helped make. Better. Better cause I'm in it. Yeah.